Okay, there we go. Okay, my name's Sky Kowalski, and I'm a junior at Lincoln Northeast. And this is a textbook definition of my father. Father, noun, a man in relation to his child or children. Father, noun, a colorful paintbrush was dipped into millions of colors to create you. The man I've learned to love, the man I've learned to hate, the man I've learned to trust, but the man I've learned to be the most afraid of. You painted my childhood with games and coloring books, but little of that I truly remember. You marked my childhood with belts to my fragile skin and yanking at my delicate wrists. As I grew, you did too. Whether that was good or bad for the either of us, I can't quite tell yet. You yell a lot like crows herding around a carcass. I mumble a lot more like a mouse afraid of the dark. You drink a lot to forget about the responsibility and reason of reality, but I go out to get away from you to forget that I am not happy. You smoke a lot, a habit I've learned from you, blacking our inside, filling our lungs with tar and poisonous heartache, blacking our insides like we want our minds to be, but you aren't necessarily your habits. I want to meet the artist, the creator of these hands that I splatter paint with, the creator of this tongue that I paint pictures with, the man who taught me to love, but the man who didn't teach me how to again after I was broken. The man I can't speak to because I'm afraid of him and his booming presence and how he may detonate if I step in the wrong places. Dad, I show you my art because you are my Picasso. I show you my poems because you are my Robert Frost. I want you to hear my words because without you they wouldn't exist. I want you to respect me just as much as I want to respect you. You have stubby fingers, the tips of which seem to be permanently stained black, like sausages dipped into syrup. You have midnight black hair, and your aging head has snow white hair scattered around it as the stars do across the night sky. You have the largest caterpillar eyebrows I've ever seen, ones I've itched to pluck for years. But knowing you never let me close enough. I don't know much about you. You won't let me in, but sometimes I get to see a part of you that no one else does. I know I make you seem like the bad guy because you can be when you let the sludge of your past boil inside of you, but I wish I could show people how witty you are when it comes to jokes, how kind and understanding you can be, how generous you have been with me and my four younger siblings compared to others. How much you love us, but I wish I could see that too. I wish I could see what I mean to you and show myself what you mean to me. I'm painting a picture of you and me, and it's the most abstract image I have ever seen.